And last we have the gnocchi mushrooms. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Mm. I'll be traveling in a couple of days and I have here some ingredients I need to finish before I leave. And so I decided to make some cabbage hot pot. Just wash the cabbage and the gnocchi mushrooms so now i'm gonna layer them with beef i have here my beef that i cut myself that's why it's not that thin and pretty <laughs> but i don't like the pre-cut frozen version so you do it just like this i just finished layering beef and cabbage and now i will just cut it And then I have here my little hot pot. And last we have the gnocchi mushrooms. Okay, what I add now is a little bit of sake. Some soy sauce. Sugar. And I have here a broth that I had with my ramen before. I just froze it and now I'm just reusing it with this. Now we just wait until it's ready. I have here a sauce that I already prepared before. I have in here some sugar, soy sauce, lemon zest, and also a squeeze of lemon. Okay, our hot pot is ready. It was really quick, just like five minutes. I'll add some spring onions. I will taste the broth first and see if it needs anything else. It's really good already, but I will add a little bit of yondu and some pepper. Okay, another taste test. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. That's how you eat it. Like that. Mmm. really good I'm trying out the enoki mushroom mm. if you are also going to travel you have some ingredients left in the fridge just throw them into a hot pot that's perfect mm. love it